Okay, so I um, <coughs> I felt like making this video, so I'm going to make it. It's the time and date, so <coughs> yes, I have not made a video in a while, uh, mainly because I didn't, I haven't felt like making a video. <laughs> So I didn't make any. Um, so uh, yeah, so this is something. I don't know. I felt compelled to talk about it because I feel like this is something. Uh, I think more people should talk about this actually. So I. I don't know if I would say I. I am. A, Or if I say I am a stalker, I mean, she makes it like, oh, it's not such a big deal. Or I have a stalking problem to make it impersonal. <clears throat> yes, so I do have this problem. Uh, It's 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 kind of good. It's it's a, it's not. It's like stalking, uh, obsession, uh, or a person. <laughs> uh, or what I think, or what I think of a person. Or imagine. This person to be. Um, it's possessiveness, uh, wanting to control their behavior. Anyway, so you get you get the idea. I mean, in 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 movies and stuff, this is like the person who's like the. In movies, a uh, stalker person is portrayed as the bad person, you know, you know who's like usually some kind of a, a domestic violence person or some crazy person or, you know. And also in the, in the news, you get like, oh, this person was stalked by this other person and they ended up, you know, <laughs> you, could, you hear all these news stories. But I believe that most people who have this problem do not, uh, at least overtly and on a consistent basis hurt other people because I, it's like you know people who have this stalking problem this kind of obsession kind of thing uh, a lot of people have it uh, and I guess some people I don't know, but I'm not talking. Yeah, it's just, it's just a. A lot of people have it, and this is like sort of like me coming out, <laughs> coming out of the closet, and revealing that I have this problem too because I feel so ashamed of it. I mean, do you want to admit to someone that you have this problem? Like you have, the, you're a stalker. I mean, do you want to say that to someone? I mean, no one wants to say that. They will think like, oh my god, you're crazy. Okay, go away from me. You know what I mean? So, but I do think it's important for me to admit this and. Uh, Yes, I, I, I have this problem. I have this problem with stalking people and the, the reason I think this is important to talk about is because, for instance, I, if I get close to someone, I find that very difficult because then I start obsessing over them and... Uh, 
sometimes even engaging in stalking behavior. <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, examples or like, I don't know. I remember when I was, uh, I remember once I met this person and I was thinking about them a lot that I ended up like, um, like taking the car and going to this shopping mall and uh, searching for them at the shopping mall because I thought they might be there. Um, <laughs> um, and uh, anyway, so that's one example. Um, the problem is having this kind of, I don't know if it's a personality, I don't think it's personality trait. I think it's a psychological problem. Well, it started. I think it started when I was sixteen years old. Cause that's the first time I had this kind of vision of this. This you know, I had this. I this when I saw this person, I was like, it felt like in the movies where all I could see was this person walking and I just, everything else froze. Like, it was like some kind of a movie scene and I'm like, who is this? And I just sort of, I don't know, I just fell in love with this person. That's the first time I saw them. And, I don't know, man. <laughs> and, uh, uh, <sighs> this problem is kind of complicated because it's it's interwoven with a lot of other issues as well you know anxiety and I don't know anyway so yeah I mean I think more people should talk about this and if they have a stalking issue or you know this obsession um, you know the controlling <laughs> potentially domestic violence or the psychotic killer <laughs> which I would say is not the most of the people understand that these things are wrong and that's why they feel ashamed of it and they might not want to like even if they have the feelings they might not share it with other people because they know how society looks down on people like this but I think it's open. It's it's important to uh, not feel live in shame. You know, I've been living in a lot of shame, and um, I knew I had it, but I just I just I, I was trying to rationalize it away and saying, oh, you know, I'm no, I'm actually a victim. Uh, you know, <laughs> no, I have this problem. I have this stalking problem. I'm yeah, I'm a stalker. Yes, yes. Uh, you know, hopefully I can. Uh, the first uh, thing is to admit you have a problem and then maybe you can get treated for it, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.